Hello guys, I'm going to show you how to verify your Google AdSense account with your Google AdSense pin. So, here it is. This pin is sent by Google via your postal address. Of course, if you have reached a payment threshold of $10. Normally, it takes two to four weeks to receive this letter. Now you might be asking yourself, why do I need this letter to verify your account? Well, this letter enables you to withdraw your payments if you have reached a payment threshold of $100. So let's get started. I'm here at, at the postal office. Uh -huh. and the and the I, I want to see you if the Google mm. sent some someone a Google answers letter to their to their postal box. Here is my number uh. one six eight nine nine and here are the here is the key. So what I want to, to do is to open this uh, this in mail, mail, mailbox mm. and see if the letter has been sent by Google by the Google themselves. Uh -huh. So let's start. So. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous to open this this box. It is it has been two weeks. Since I, I applied for the pin, mm -hmm. so let let cut let me cut to the chase. Mm -hmm. Go again. Are you sure it is inside? Go 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 go. Okay. Let me breathe. Wow. Wow, it is inside. Holy shit! Man. Holy shit! Oh my god. Wow. Yeah, it is. My pin is inside. So I'll 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 take you through the 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 procedure to open and fuck. Rono. Okay. Yeah it is. My Google. The Google has sent me the Google Answers letter. Here it is. So I would like to thank my subscribers, all the people who watch my videos. Continue watching my videos. I'm so excited. I'll show you how to, uh, to go about it. It's a uh, Google. It has been sent by Google. It's called Google Adsense. It's a letter. So I'll show you how to go about it. Thank you so much for my subscribers. Nice. Let's get started. We will begin by opening this letter. As you can see, this letter is somewhat transparent. You, you'll be able to see the, the pin even before opening it. Alternatively, you can remove the edges. The, you, as you can see, there are marks which, which you will be able to open easily. So let's remove the edges. I'm so nervous, guys. You can use a scissor or, or something sharp to, to open so that you will not mess up with the letter. I love Google. See guys, it is easy to, to remove the edges even without using your hand so guys i'm through with with removing the edges here it is here is my pin 
Wow. There are six digits. I think normally they send six digits. Google answers. You have Google answers. Personal identification number PIN. So guys, I'll take you through the procedure on now to verify your account. Thank you. So first you'll want to sign into your Google account. So you'll just want to go to accounts.google.com and sign into your AdSense account. So as you can see, I've been brought to this screen. Select your Google account. I'll select the first and you'll want to input your password. So just input your password and click on next. So I'll just input my password and when you click on next, you'll be brought to your AdSense account. So as you can see here, I have my account and you'll notice that I have a red bar at the top that says you are Payments are currently on hold, but I'll be showing how to fix this in this video. So you'll want to click on payments as you can see where I'm hovering my mouse right now. So just click on payments and you'll be brought to this screen. So as you can see, my current earnings are below the threshold, but we'll talk about that later. So you'll want to go to these settings here and you'll click on manage settings. As you can see where I'm hovering my mouse, click on that option right there so you'll be brought to this account where you can see all your account details and i want you to scroll to the bottom where you can see your address so just click where you can see your name and address so just click on that to edit it so just click on that and as you can see now we can edit it so you'll want to input your name first and your address remember you can input two addresses but only one is needed so just input your exact address and make sure to input your exact name so just input your address name and phone number as you can see that's exactly what is needed you don't have to input your second address line that's optional but you can input it if you have an extra address line so as soon as you've done this you'll want to save that information also make sure to update to the latest address that you are at currently so after you've done that you'll want to go to home so just go to home and you'll notice that we have this tab right here that you have a message written verify your billing address as you can see we mailed a pin on september 17 so for me it was mailed on september 12th so as you can see you'll click on that verify button so just click on that verify and you'll want to input the pin that was sent to you so the the pin should look as the one seen on screen also i want you to comment about how i look in this photo in the description down below so You'll want to input that pin exactly as it appears in your Google AdSense mail that was sent to you. So just input that pin and make sure to input exactly because you only have three tries. So just input that and you'll click on submit. So input it exactly as it is and click on submit. And as you can see, when I click on submit, When you click on submit, as you can see, your billing address has been verified and now you're good to go. So next, I want to show you how to set up your payment so that you can get paid immediately you reach the threshold. So as you can see, I still have the red bar. Don't, my, don't worry about that. It will go away in a few days. So again, you'll go back to payments and this time you'll want to click on how you get paid. As you can see, just click on add payment method so when you click on the add payment method you'll you'll be taken to the screen where you can set up your payment information and remember this is very important i recommend that you use our, the western union method if it's accessible in your country so just select the western union and you'll want to enter your name as you can see confirm recipient name you want to input the name that is in your government provided identification card make sure it's exactly because you'll be needing your government provided identification card to confirm it's you to receive your payment so input your first and last name and i recommend that you check first before entering this so just input your first and last name as they appear in the government id and after that you'll want to set this as primary method as you can see you want to tick that so tick the set as primary method option and also you want to agree to the terms so after inputting your name you'll want to tick both of these options so just make sure to tick both of these and also ensure 
to input your name exactly as it is in your government provided an identification card so as soon as you've ticked this you'll want to click on save so make sure that you have all of this correct and click on save so just take your time here and click on save so as soon as you've done this just click on save and wait for it to refresh So as you can see, our Western Union payment method is the primary method and it's all set up. So as soon as you've done this, you're good to go and now you can receive payments as soon as you reach the threshold.